Hey guys, it's Veronica with Change in Love and this is video blog number 32. I am super excited because today I spoke with my mentor, Miss Natalie Goucher. Um, she's actually the person who's even hosting this video challenge. She's the only reason that I've been <laughs> trying to um, continuously upload my video blogs and remain as consistent as I have been. Um, I think it's really, really important to have people like that in your corner who are helping you and supporting you and pushing you and your efforts to really pursuing what it is that you you want and to financially help yourself um, do what it is that you love. So shout out to Miss Nali Gishay and Empower Network because this is truly like something that is so inspiring and it it's so helpful because... Like I said, in recording these video blogs, I would have never, I would have never really, like, I know that I encourage freedom of expression, but I think that it's something that we all go through, especially if you come from a strong cultural background, whereas you're taught to not voice your opinions and you're not, and you're taught to not talk back to your parents, regardless if they are wrong, you, you just got to kind of keep your mouth shut and you know take it as it is and I think coming into this challenge and even like um in my business goals and my personal goals for myself I came in with that kind of attitude whereas you know of just doubting myself and uh, being fearful of, of really coming out with something that I felt like was necessary and I felt like um, was important to the to my generation so um, thank you, Miss Natalie, for really encouraging me that and may making me realize that um, when we got off our conversation, I had I was doing some reading and I was like um, doing my homework up on uh, for uh, just touching up on some things with Empower Network, and something that really stood out stood out to me was that uh, it's, it was a quote that said that once you realize that there is something to be realized, that's when your realization has begun, and you know like it's so true like. You know, you, you can't really knock knock yourself in wanting or having the desire to change. Even though you haven't completely, you know, reached, um, you know, what it, whatever it is that you were trying to reach and, you know, pursuit of your happiness. It's important to, like, you know, credit yourself and acknowledge the fact that you're even trying and that you're, at least you notice these things and at least that you, you want to do something about it. And that's the next step is overcoming those things and actually just doing it. So um, I was really um, inspired and empowered by your words, Natalie. So thank you for that. And um, to my generation, you know, don't let your um, circumstances change your attitude. You should let, you should remain focused and let your attitude kind of control your circumstances and let them change. Let the positive state of mind and um, being optimistic, let that change your circumstances. And, um, you know, don't, don't, um, don't s sabotage yourself. <laughs> Basically, don't sabotage yourself. So I promise that within my next videos, this is 32, I still have like, um, what is it, 20, 28, 28 videos to go. I promise that for every video after this is going to be something that I am going to conquer and, and a fear that I am going to overcome. And, um, you know, I'm no longer going to use that way of thinking that we were taught growing up and, you know, a strong culture of family to be fearful and be scared to voice your opinion and be, um, you know, being able to stand for what you believe in and hold your ground regardless of, you know, what could happen um, you know, I'm grown, so I, I don't really care if I say something back to my parents and they put hands on me. <laughs> well, I'm not grown, but you guys get the idea. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you guys enjoy my videos. Thank you for continuously supporting the movement and change in love. And, um, and, and actually, you know, really empowering your own efforts and your own, um, personal achievements and your goals that you're working towards. It's really important that you understand that change in love is who you who you are and what you do for yourself. So thank you for watching my videos. I'm going over my time. I'll see you guys in my next video. Change a lot of that.